quick little thing. Um, I actually wanted to show everybody the uh, attachments as far as IR illuminators went between the Mall and the Peck. Uh, they revamped them quite a bit. I was really happy with them, how they did them. Uh, I have a little couple complaints as far as the pistol 3 by goes. Um, but uh, that's here and there. I think I'd like to showcase these attachments first. So I found the darkest hole I could find for this purpose. It's all about your night vision. And so let's go over here and we'll show you what I have attached just real quick like before we get all into all the fancies. I got over here I have the mall on the M4 assault. I have the PEC on the M110 and these are just for the to show you purposes um, so that you can because I really wanted to so they're actually true to form the mall is the M4 the mall is just a, a spotlight alright so it's really meant for outdoor work it gives you a long distance to see you can see a lot you know, really really out there as far as that goes way up there as a matter of fact okay uh, opposite for the peck the peck is a floodlight so it's great for for indoor all right it doesn't bleach your light out you can still see it and you can get up close and personal with it it's not blinding like the mall all right it just bleaches your 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 dot out almost completely rather than the peck. So that is the biggest difference. I wanted to show you all that. I found that the other night. I thought that was super cool how they revamped that entire thing. So it's really great. The outdoor the peck doesn't do anything. Once you get out a certain couple feet or so it's it's done. It doesn't do a damn thing for you. Whereas the mall will show you the spotlight as to what you want to see. Alright, something to keep in mind. See that? I thought that was super fucking cool. And when you put them on your back, it shows you a good difference too between the peck and the mall. One's a spot, one's a flood. Big difference. Just really great what they did with that. Uh, now, I want to go into my little rant with the Pistola. Uh, I love... I'll turn this off. I love the handgun laser, HDG laser on the handgun over the 3x. The 3x, they, they need to revamp it. Uh, it's pretty obvious they didn't touch it at all. There we go. There we go. They didn't, they just, just didn't, when you get, it's even worse at close quarters. You know, that thing should look like a, a predator triangle sight, and those red dots should be the same as this. There it is. It should be the same as this red dot. So we should have three red dots this size coming out of this thing, instead of these three tiny little things that don't give you any range speak of. And it's not bad. It's not bad at that range. Alright, but then we go over to the laser. It, uh, oh, look at that. So the three by actually looks a little better on the outside. I can actually see that a little better though, myself. Interesting. So if you go inside, it shows up very against the walls and in the dark. Interesting. So. This shows up way better on the inside. It even has a red gleam around it. 
Wow, that's amazing. Well, there you have it, guys. There you have it. Alright, so I hope you got something out of this as much as I did. I have now started to use the peck when I get on the indoor work. And I use the mall when I'm outdoors. Uh, I do a lot of night work. I really enjoy that myself. So, alright, there you go, guys. I'm signing off.